she's a different type of girl in a different type of world. <laughs> I'm so silly. It's Neva and I am back again with another video. Today's video is going to be another wig review and as you can see, hey, she is on her head. Uh, let me stop saying that and speaking in third person. As you can see, the wig is on my head and um, I'm so excited to be reviewing this wig because it's something that I seen and thought was really cute and I wore it to a really special place and I think she fit in just right at this really special place so I am so happy to introduce her to my channel okay <clears throat> and I am coming down with a little well I do have a coat so excuse me for that but um, I bought this wig because I was going to a concert the Beyonce concert to be exact and I wanted something that was kind of Beyonce-ish and I felt like she was Beyonce-ish so I went ahead and took her to the club did I say the club I meant to say concert as you know in my previous video I am new to the wig scene I do not wear wigs or I have not worn a wig and I'm not very experienced with the wig and so I went ahead and tried something a little more affordable before I started to, you know, purchase these wigs that were on the higher end side just to see if I liked it or wanted to even wear a wig. So after experimenting with that one wig, I decided, oh, I like the wig because even though it was a wig from the beauty supply store and it was it was synthetic, um, it was nothing wrong with it. Like y'all better get up on the synthetic game of the wigs i mean it's not like you're gonna be wearing this for the rest of your life or it's just an option to put in your closet or to put in your hair what's the word i don't know your hair what is the word i'm looking for i don't know some of these wigs can be very expensive and sometimes it is not what you expect it to be or you're not wearing it as much as you should or think you should when you pay that much money. When I bought this wig, I'm just like, I wouldn't be mad if I don't wear this wig every day. Of course, you wouldn't wear this wig every day because it's synthetic, but I would not beat myself up for not wearing this wig as much as I should have because it, I didn't pay that much. So I think it's very smart. Um, and you know save your coins ladies save it you don't need to be spending your money all in one place like that it's, it's other ways to spend money go on vacations you know invest you know buy a house do all that good stuff with your coins go, you don't have to spend all that money on hair I mean sometimes maybe but not all the time and you have you can have options you know for you don't have to be wearing the same wig all the time you can have options I saw this wig on YouTube, and you know what, YouTube, we're going to have a conversation. Because you know exactly what I'll be looking for. You you know how to get into my pockets, don't you? Like, you know how you be searching for something, you found that something, you're like, okay, cool. But then you're on the feed, like, a week later, days later, and you see something else in that same category that you may like, and, you know, it draws your attention, and you're like, oh, let me click on that and see if I like it. But you know you shouldn't, because that means you're going to be in your pockets, and that's exactly what happened to me. Okay? They got me. You know, they, they got me. But it's okay because I actually love this wig. So anyway, let's get back on track. So um, I went to the Beyonce concert and I wanted something that fit the occasion. And I found her, they had her in another color that was more subtle, but I wanted to not be subtle. I wanted to be Beyonce-ish, Sasha Fierce-ish, okay, ish. I wanted to be that. So I said, no, let me get this color. I don't know how it's gonna look. My mom looked at me, she was like, you really gonna get that color? I was like, yeah, girl, I'm gonna get this color. She's like, you sure you gonna get this color, girl? I said, what's wrong with this color? She's like, nah, I'm just saying, like, you know, it's kind of different. And you, is it gonna go go together with everything? And I said, well, we just gonna see, okay? We just gonna put it all together and see what's going on. And then, you know, we gonna see what I can work with. She was like, okay, girl, it's your world. So go ahead and get your wig. Go ahead and get your unit. I know you're gonna turn it out to be good. I'm like, yeah, girl, just wait and watch. Just wait and watch. And it was cool, okay? 
Anyways, back on track. The brand that I'm wearing today is from the brand Freetress Equal. And it is the um, style Katron or Kitron or I think it's Katron. And it's in the color OP27. Here is the packaging of where she came from. This is her on the model, if you could see. Yeah. So and I think the model is wearing an OP430. I decided to, I wanted some more color, so I decided to go to OP27. Um, it is a lace deep invisible L part, and I paid $49.99 for this wig. Um, they do have this wig on Sam's Beauty and Sister Wigs, I believe, and a lot of other wig companies. But when I wanted to purchase this particular color um, and this style, they didn't have it, so I decided to just go to my beauty supply store. It would have rounded up to be the same with shipping and handling. Um, so, yeah. So, the first thing about this wig. Let's get into the pros and the cons. Dun, dun, dun. Okay, so the pros. We're going to go to the pros. It's over here, y'all. Pros over here. Okay, this wig is very lightweight. The wig is... Should I say, should I be saying wig or unit? Y'all let me know. I don't know the correct lingo. You know, I'm still new at this unit wig game. So I'm going to say unit. I think that's what they say. So the unit is very lightweight. It is, um, the hair is very flowy with it. It did not come out the pack like this. This is me wearing it probably a few times. And, um, it, the curls were more uniform now I like it because it's messy curls and I don't know I just like my hair to be all over the place when it's at a, at a natural state even my natural hair so this is how like the curl in the front it was like big curls like this all over the head and then it just broke down to smaller curls as I'm like playing with it I have not experienced any shedding. I also have not combed this hair or brushed this hair, so I'm not sure if it sheds. I'm quite sure it would, but by me just wearing it, it doesn't shed, so that's a plus for me. Um, what did bother me about this hair is the length. This hair was extremely long for me. I am only five feet, five one on a good day, and um, this hair was long. It went all the way down my back and to me when it does that especially with, with synthetic hair um sometimes it could look a little fake even with nat like human raw hair um sometimes when it's too long it just doesn't look natural so i decided to cut this hair i cut a few inches off well a lot of inches off and i think i already showed this but that's how i cut it right here it's like to bra strap lip and this kind of matches my personality. Um, and that's what one thing you want to do when you get a wig that I've noticed is you want to make the wig, the unit, um, match your personality, fit you. So I had to do that in some way. I may cut this hair a little more, but for right now, she's good. She's good. That could be something I lead up to when as the hair gets older. Um, so yeah, the length... That was a problem for me, but at the same time, I cut it, so wasn't a problem at all. Um, the combs. Okay, so it has two combs in the front and one comb in the back. Um, it also has a drawstring to tighten. Not a drawstring. What am I talking about? Elastic bands um, inside the unit to tighten or loosen up the wig. Uh, what I had an issue with or what I wish that they would have done with this wig is made two combs on the side I feel like with those two two combs on the side my unit would stay on my head and I wouldn't have to worry about it sliding shifting or you know when the wind blows me it flying in the air I wouldn't have to worry about that because it's going to be secure so I just wish they would have had two combs on the side but you know, just have to work with what you have. And I guess I can sew in um, some combs if I felt the need to. Right now, I don't. I mean, it's cool, but I have not combed this wig or brushed this wig. So, with that being said, this is just how it's been by me wearing it. 
and this is probably like my fifth time wearing it and when I say when I went to Beyonce concert I wore this wig that day like not even that whole weekend but that particular night I wore this wig because I, I don't know, I haven't really been to a lot of concerts, but I decided this year I'm going to whatever, so I've been to going to, I've been going to a lot of concerts. So when Beyonce came around, I was like, oh yes, we're going to that concert. Because I went to that concert and because I paid money to see Beyonce, this and my whole body was about to experience everything. Like I was about to be, no, I wasn't, I was, I was dancing the whole time i was on my feet the whole time feet were killing me because i had heels like a silly person but anyway um i'm on my feet the whole time just rocking away my head was it went through some things that night and i'm not mad about it because i have the time of my life i had fun but yeah this week she held on she was like i'm going to beyonce concert too and i'm about to rock out with you and that's exactly what she did. Um, so, by me saying that, this wig does tangle. And where it tangles at is in the back, in, the, in my nape area. That's where it tangled the most. And I just know that it's because I was sweating and dancing and doing all kinds of stuff at the Beyonce concert. Because I was getting my life as Beyonce was getting hers on that stage. So, yeah, this, it does not shed in the front, which is good. I haven't experienced anything like that, but I have experienced shedding, not shedding, I'm sorry, tangling in the front, but I have experienced tangling in the back, and it's cool because nobody should be in the back of your head like that anyway, and if they are, then ugh, they deserve to see all kinds, they deserve to get tangled in that, because what you doing in the back of my head? Like, what you doing all back here? That's the kitchen. You stay out the kitchen, okay? Stay out the ki stay out of my kitchen. Go into your own kitchen, okay? Yeah, that is this wig. Again, this is the style Catron. Um, and it is from Free Trist Equal. And I got mine from the Beauty Supply Store. So, yes, thank you for tuning in. And um, if you have not subscribed to my channel, go ahead and do so, girl. What you waiting on? What you waiting on? Go ahead and press that subscribe button. Subscribe to my channel. Subscribe to my channel. Subscribe to my channel. Subscribe. Subscribe. Subscribe to my channel. Subscribe to my channel. Subscribe. Gone girl, gone girl, subscribe. Gone girl, gone girl, subscribe. Gone girl, gone girl, subscribe. 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 Just press that button. Just press the button, girl. <sighs> Just subscribe. <laughs> subscribe. And watch. And, tell, and share the love, y'all. Go ahead and share the love if you like the video. If you think somebody else would love to wear this wig or would love to know about this unit, go ahead and share the love. That's it. Just share the love. So, yes. Thank you for watching, and I will see you in my next video. Bye.